you've seen this guy on Speed Channel for about the last four or five years. We had a chance to work with this guy when we were on Speed Channel. It was kind of a match made in heaven with myself because it's two zany, it's two, it's two zany dudes together. Not in a romantic way, although oh, I know yeah. you've, you've kind of had that affinity for me for a while, Rutledge. Well, you're hot stuff. I understand that. Let's just get that out there. I am hot you're stuff. An attractive and, dude. And, 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 and the preparation with your hair and, and your, your beard is really tasty. So we do appreciate, appreciate you coming on with Live 105.3. Thank you. I, w- I would have appreciated that more if that came from Crash, that, that wonderful description. Right. I would have liked that more. Right. I'm sorry. I need to get the microphone closer to my nose. Yeah. How's that? Is that better? <laughs> Is that so, better? I don't so want to blow any speakers out. All right, out. You're, in, you're in town for the Cup and Nationwide Race uh, for Speed Channel. And you were introduced to a certain phenomenon here in North Texas. <laughs> was it Friday night? Friday night, known as the Rodeo. My first... Now no, no, I no, understand. the Mesquite I'm sorry, rodeo. you're right. The Mesquite Rodeo, mm-hmm. they pulled out all the stops for us. And I have to say, it was absolutely awesome. Fascinating. Top to bottom, I realized that I, I never really thought I'm that tough, but I've redefined what tough is and what crazy is. I don't think... Well, you've redefined crazy? Yeah, because now, you know, we're out here every weekend and we think these guys ride around 190 miles an hour. They're nuts. They're not strapped to an angry (laughs) thousand pound animal that is pretty sure it wants them dead. That's a whole, this is a whole different beast. And the Mesquite Rodeo was awesome. I will say it took longer to get the smell of horse manure out of my sinuses than I'd originally thought. Would you ever consider being one of those rodeo clowns? I, I had thought that would be funny. They, they suggested maybe I should go to rodeo clown school, and I pointed out that, that I do f- fun stuff that's silly, not fun stuff that's stupid or <laughs> that I could uh, get killed at. So, Did you have your Speed Channel cameras there at the rodeo? I did. It, was, it just aired a few minutes ago, and my dad said it looked great. Nice. So that's good. If you get the family support, maybe other people like it. Rutledge, <laughs> Rutledge joins us here on Live 105. He crashed Gladys and Kenny Sargent. I've always had a problem. I was born and raised in Dallas. I never went to the Mesquite Rodeo. I've, we had a farm up in McKinney, but I always had a problem being within about 100 yards of an animal whose huevos were bigger than my head. They're, <laughs> I'll agree. I mean, it's... You know? I, I don't know how to put it in terms that are acceptable for the radio. <laughs> it was... It's unbelievable. Man, that's a full meal for a family of seven right yeah, there. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> And then wow! Some. Wow! <laughs> Don't you know? Next time you go to Dairy Queen, you get a foot long hot dog. You're yeah. not going to be as impressed once you go That's to the rodeo. That's true. Yeah. So hold on a second, Rutledge. <laughs> you do all crazy things for Speed Channel in the NASCAR world. I mean, I've seen you out at some bars late, late night with some hot chicks. I mean, I've seen you do tons of stuff. What's the craziest thing? Did this rodeo <laughs> top the, the all the crazies? Um, or is there more? See, there's there's a difference. There's crazy fun, and there's crazy. I can't believe I did that. I won't do it again. Crazy <laughs> fun would have been. Vegas a few weeks ago, we, we went out and we thought, let's just go to the strip, let's have fun. And I forgot that people in Vegas could be drunk at 10 a.m., they could be <laughs> wasted by 2. So we went out at 6, and I thought, oh, it'll be fine, these people will be sober. No, it was, everyone had a major case of the Wasteds. We were trying to <laughs> make a joke about Denny's, which I love. Uh, yes, yes. Great place, and I was trying to make a joke about Moons how. over Miami, love Yeah, it. who doesn't? About all the wonderful <laughs> restaurants, I kept trying to point to this sign kind of making fun of Denny's a little uh-huh. bit. And these three dudes with eight-foot-tall drinks wasted out of their mind just couldn't grasp the concept that they weren't going to be on TV with me and oh. that we had to move on. So that was that pushed the line of these guys might beat me up because we're not getting them on TV. But crazy, I don't ever do it again, but was awesome was when I got to ride in the F-16 Ooh. with the Thunderbirds in Daytona. Wow. It's uh, one... Uh, pleased for myself that I could fit in the plane. I'm not a small dude, you mm-hmm. know, 6'3". Um, wow, that's ridiculous. We hit 9.1 Gs. I have this sweet, I hit 9 Gs pin. No you way. notice here. Hey, no everybody way. on the website. Hey, that's the pin I'm talking about. <laughs> Log on, 105.3. Uh, so <laughs> it was, it was. Did you puke? I did not puke. I wanted to. That's cool. Thank you. I know. Holy. A lot of people thought I was a puker. I will say my favorite quote that didn't make the piece was when I told the guy, <laughs> uh, I don't know whether I want to puke or soil my pants. Did and you do the other one? Actually, no, you didn't puke. No, thought oh. about that also. Neither one. Your wow. body goes into this just cloud of nothing because you go from, hey, totally fine, this is great, to out of your mind wasted like that. I went to <laughs> University of Georgia. We drank a lot at school. I'm not going to lie. I don't remember many of the football games. We far surpassed any of those days in an instant. So, And how great. No hangover. Nothing. Well, I couldn't move for the next three hours. Ooh. After that, I was fine. It was a good time. Though Air Force is amazing what those guys do. It was great. Rutledge from Speed Channel joins us here on Live 105.3. Crash Gladys and Kenny Sargent. After the 
F-18? Uh, 16. F-16 incident. You talk about not being wasted. Now, hold on just a second. With those that amount of Gs, yeah, for, for the entire day, you're toast, aren't oh, you? Oh, I was out. I mean, I, you could have you could have punched me. I wouldn't have known who did yeah. it. It was, I was just laid out. They can, You also can get these things they call Jeezles, uh, which I thought was a hip-hop term at first, you know, with people <laughs> use the term G a lot. I guess, I guess it's not. The high Gs. And they look like measles that you get from the high Gs. I didn't get that. I just got the, I'm pretty sure I want to throw up or not be awake the rest of the days. But, wow. Meanwhile, these guys are going out for hours. They do that all the time. That's hey, insane. do you have a website? Uh, I don't, but I'm on. Well, I'm on my yeah, space. MySpace. I'm on the MySpace. Yeah, MySpace. MySpace. You can check out MySpace. Right <laughs> at MySpace.com backslash Rutledge Wood. And he is a friend of the freaks, Send and he's also messages. a friend of Crash Gladys. So yes. I'll, I'll put him up in the top friends so you guys can all see him. But on SpeedTV.com, they can see where you're going. Yeah, next. you can see a ridiculous picture of me that I took my first year, and a bio that my mom wrote. That's pretty nice. terrible. Your that's mom. Beautiful. She's wonderful. It sounds like someone's mom wrote it. That is beautiful. <laughs> Gee's back there giving some silence. Yeah. yeah. Speaking of cheese. Was he giving? I was afraid he was giving us. The old, the classic. Do we have to wrap it up? Everybody at home, we do have get to, on the yeah. website. This is how you do it. Right. <laughs> this means I need a sandwich, and there's other signs that Kenny uses that we can't we can't show on.